Hello everybody, and welcome to something a little bit different. So this is Cattle and Crops, and it's like really, really weird to play. Uh, it's fun, but it's very odd. So I'm going to do something I haven't seen a lot of people do, uh, is do like the Maze Harvest. Everybody wants to go through like the beginning missions, so um, this is still one of the uh, starting missions, but it's, it's not, if that makes any kind of sense. So, it basically, I've done all the things to learn. Oh, okay, and that guy's going to drive. So, yeah, there's, like, really weird things. Like, I can drive to the place, and or I can hit in, and, and the tractor will drive itself. And I've never done a mission with another helper. So, yeah, this is kind of neat. So, he's going to drive himself to the field. And what we're going to do is we're going to chop some... Uh, Corn down out of field 13, which isn't that far. It's like up here and around the corner. So I've done all the plowing work for it. I've done all the, the other stuff for it. And basically, this is uh, this is like normal gameplay. And this thing has like so many things uh, like going on with it. Uh, this panel over on the right side here uh, has like all of these controls and everything, right? And you can click. Like everything's icy. Um, like that there was for the front arms. You know, put them up or put them out. And, like there's so many things. Like I can roll down windows by a set amount. Um, it's really, really cool. Um, but it is a laggy mess right now. I cannot stress that enough. As much as I do complain about my computer, it is pretty powerful. Uh, right now I am chugging. I mean, it's it's like a slideshow on my end. So it's probably going to be about 30 FPS on an output, right? Um, but yeah, other things that we can do. We've got you turn the four-wheel drive out. I'm going to leave that out, and that's important. Uh, this game does have uh, terrain. That, like, it actually works, right? So we're going to leave that out, and I'm probably going to sink, which is okay. Because uh, you can just engage it and drive back out. But, uh, yeah, like, the, the terrain actually works. And what else can we say about it? Uh, it's mainly, like, cloths. Uh, we have a Mercedes, too, which I love. I love it, love it, love it. Um, yeah, there's, like, I've never done this. So I am learning as I go on. I've put about three hours into this game so far. Just going through, like, the tutorials, learning how to take out animals and everything. Everything is more hands-on. Everything is really, really slow-paced. It's not like you hit it, you get it, you're done, right? So, we're going to see what this guy's about. Build what you have. Okay. So, he's going to auto-detect, just like an FS. And we're going to drive right beside of him. Hopefully. Yeah, he's going to detect. Yeah, that comes out of there. A good little neck. Uh, the filling is a little weird. Uh, it does do like a texture stretch, and you can see some artifacting and everything. But it is pretty cool. And we go inside and hit the buttons. There's like switches and do like all this stuff. And I tell you what it is like toggle full drive, general mod, you know, th things like that. I better keep up with my dude here. Uh, the models feel very FS15-ish. They're not really polished games in a beta. We can see uh, how those wheels are sticking here. So it's not as pretty as FS19. Like, by a long shot, it's not as pretty. But as far as controls go, it's really, really good. Like, I love how everything is, like totally hands-on, everything's really, really, like, the driving part of it is really, really nice. Uh, everything has some weight, you see, I'm, like, full on, I'm full board, we're at 2100 RPM right now, and barely turning. Uh, also have the graphics, except for, uh, textures. Oh, that's, uh, oh, you're gonna go this way, okay, was not expecting you to, yeah, I'm used to up and back, right? So, this is, this is new, this is really, really cool. Um, I kind of wish we got to drive the Jaguar, though. 
because I really want to drive in the field. So we'll, we'll get to drive in the field in the next pass. But yeah, I, I've never seen anybody uh, like uh, like do this. Oh, I need to speed up. Look here. I mean, it's, it piles up. It continues to pile up. Like, you can do this uh, wrong, by the way. So you need to you need to, to do the things right. Um, so yeah, well, that's what we're trying to do. Let's let's try to make it look kind of good, uh, or or it's gonna look like a giant turd, right? But yeah, it, it's it's definitely different. It's um, a lot slower paced. Uh, it's more hands on. The animal system so far is kind of neat, uh, and the, the skip job, so, like, if I didn't want to do this whole job, I could totally, like, skip this. No problem, right? I'm glad that they've got this shooting so far, because this would be very annoying. I don't know what the worker system is like, though. Not yet, anyway. Uh, I'm gonna do the whole, the whole king of it. Okay, we're gonna turn. Uh, you, you can see, like, as I zoom out, the trailer gets empty. But if I zoom in, you know, it. Uh... Wait, dude, dude, you're missing. Wow, you're missing like a lot of things. I'm glad you stopped. Okay, you're getting kind of wonky here. Oh well. So yeah, we're going to drive in his tracks. I kind of wish that... It, yeah, you see how we're spinning? So... And I'm sinking, right? You can bury. Like, not like bury, bury, but... Uh, we can... <laughs> like, throw mud. Now, like, it's, it's really, really cool. Um, I paid like $20. I got it on sale, right? I've had enough laughs. Um... I, I mean, basically, it costs you 20 bucks to go to a movie, right? So... Where are you going, dude? Dude, he's going ham right now. Yeah, see here how we're spending so much? And look how far the trailer sunk in. This is neat. I'm... I'm, like, really... I know I've said, like, really, really fun, but... Ten times. But anyway, so we're going to try to finish out this job with this guy and see, you know, what exactly is going on. We're almost full ourselves. We're at like uh, 9,000 gallons out of 13,000 gallons. So the whole measurement system is a lot different. But we see, you know, how much the, the trailer is sinking in. Um... Even the stubbles move, so that's like kind of neat. Um, what else is kind of neat? Like this whole this whole thing is uh, pretty. It's a pretty good exercise in something. I'm not gonna say that it's a uh, an awesome you know game. It's fun for sure, um, but you gotta like take it in spurts, right? Hoping to get like the last of this. Are you just gonna like fill up forever? But yeah, okay. So we dug there, right? If I if I keep spinning, okay. Let's just do a little experiment. So I'm digging down. It's like a set amount. Now our trailer can go down in it. See how far we're sunk down into the trailer now. Let's see if we can continue to, to go down. I want to know what the limit of this is. Oh, better get it in my tracks, huh? I think right at the base of the wheel. We're like right there, right? I think that's as low as it can go, right? Yeah, we're we're at the base of the wheel, so that's as low as it can go. Pull the trailer into it. 
And we are... If I can get out of my butt, Cam. Here we go. You see how low we are? We're almost dragging Axel. Like, that is really, really cool. I wish... Um, I know... Okay, here's the thing. I have to be that guy. I wish that Farming Sim had this. But I said myself many times that the tech wasn't there yet. The Giant's engine is polished enough. Uh, this is the C4 engine or whatever it is uh, running on this. Um, I don't know anything about it. But I do know that the engine the Giant's uses should be more than capable of what this is doing without like an awful lot of work. And to do it better. So... It's kind of sad that this has become, like if we took Farming Sim and this and put them together, I believe I'd have like probably one of the best games. I'd have a ton of fun, just like honestly messing around. Everything has mass too, like I'm full, it's extremely hard to move. Uh, let me turn on that four wheel drive. All right. Gonna want to unload into the silo. Let's see, you. And it's going. Now, don't believe you've got to be like anywhere. It, it just kind of fills itself, right? So it's just a trigger. It's like going to fill this. Yeah, you can see it kind of growing. You look down right below my wheel. The area there is getting just a shade bigger. And I think we're raising up off the ground too. Yeah. Okay. So that's how that works. I don't really enjoy how it unloads. I think Farming Sim might have a better unload. But in general, this isn't this isn't bad. So I'm driving back to the Jaguar. They give me like three trailers and all this other stuff. I don't know what all we're doing today. Uh, maybe this guy has like more than one field that has to be done because it's like a contract slash learning mission, right? But the game kind of dumbs everything down. Like, it, it, there's no like. Oh, yeah, we've got more to do. Um, there's nothing that's uh, like set in stone. Like, everything is kind of wishy wash, right? They, they want you to learn. Oh, I get to drive. Oh, sweet. Okay, so we're going to drive. We can run, and I can kind of see my guy. If I can... Uh, no, I've got an ugly face anyway. We don't want to see. Hey. Whoa. Oh, I'm in the vehicle. Harvest the field. Okay, let's unfold. Let's see what this thing looks like on the inside. The camera is a little janky. But overall, pretty good. Okay, so did that... Oh, he did get a driver. Okay. So, let's turn it on. I'm gonna go. Alright, so this is... This is pretty cool. So, we're... We're doing the thing now. We're harvesting. And we're gonna do... One of my fine maneuvers here. See, I wanted to drive behind and He's just... Through it, I'm gonna stick on your butt, which is okay. Like the fall mean is, is okay. Um, the texture on the crops is—is is it 3D? It looks really cool. And the stubble, like everything, looks right but wrong. If that makes any kind of sense. Um, I think that. Uh, the game overall has a very mm, it feels like it's from a couple years ago um, if it had been updated a little bit with a little bit fresher models uh, hopefully it is still in development so hopefully uh, you know we can continue to see some growth um, me and uh, Simsation Daniel were talking about it on his discord what was that uh, two days ago or something and like, we both had the same thought. If this had been 
bruh. Bruh. What are you doing, brother? Okay, so I messed that up. Okay, so apparently it likes to go in a square. Um, but yeah, we, we both had the same thing. If this game had come out uh, and done well in 15, then this is what everybody would be playing right now. Um, you know, because they would have had that much more influx of income for development. But it didn't. So this is what we have. Um, there are a bunch of features I really, really like. I'm enjoying the, you know, modified terrain. Hopefully, uh, the next time we play, I can do a little bit of plowing because plowing is pretty cool. Uh, you can definitely drive down inside the rut. Um, it feels heavy. It feels slow. But it doesn't take as long, if that makes any sense. Like, the fields are smaller for that reason. So... My dude, my dude, right now, you are, like, I don't know how I'm supposed to work the worker, right? I'm really used to, to farm sims workers, so this is kind of weird. Oh, now I've, I've really pissed this guy off. Come on, Hans. Get off of me, Hans. Dude, bruh. Stay in your lane or whatever. I don't know what to tell you. Like, you're over there now, dude. I don't, I don't know what to tell you, man. man. Yeah, you, you, you done goofed. Hopefully we didn't... Uh, this, um, this is a mess. Of course I made a mess of it. Why wouldn't I make a mess of something so simple as uh, cutting maze, right? But normally, we'll have a skip button here. Like, if I wanted to skip this job, right? Uh, we could do that. But, no, I don't. So, there it is. Yeah, you can destroy crops too. So he destroyed a ton of stuff. Being the fine person that he is. We'll definitely call him Hans. He feels like a Hans. Come on, my brother. Oh, he's, he's going for the ram right now. Stay there, dude. It'll be okay. I promise. We're not gonna... Yeah, I, I'm not where he wants me to be. He doesn't know what to do right now. Which is fine. Like, it's it's trying to figure it out there, right? So the programming there is probably pretty cool. Because a farming sim AI has never tried to figure out shit. We've had to mod it to get... Uh, to get followed me and stuff. So this guy doing. So I'm driving the field 14. Okay. Don't know where field 14 is. We're gonna hit that. Hit this. Um. Okay. Yeah. There he goes. It's not slow either. Like this thing's pretty quick. This is pretty neat. And we've got like a total time on our mission, which is different than my recording time. I don't know why that is. Um, I didn't sit around for four minutes, I don't think. Maybe I did. Oh, I had to drive there. That's correct. I started and had to drive and then started eight. I'm like, why am I five minutes behind? Oh, look. Okay, he's already going to where we're going. Unless this is like AI farmers doing things. Dude, I swear to God if you ran me. I'm not switching with you. Where's field 14? What? Where am I supposed to be at? Did I pass it? Where are these guys going? They will follow them. Okay, so where is field 14?
Wait, where are these guys going? Like, it don't have any of the field members. I don't know. Uh. I don't know what field I'm supposed to be in, and they're not marked. Brother, get your man out the way there. I'll bet you it's like right here somewhere. Is it my field? Are we doing my field? <gasps> no way. Is this it? Okay, I'm gonna unfold it. We're gonna see. Um, or what are the chances of it being that one or this one? You just... Okay, that's really cool. So we get to do the whole thing. And they're just going to follow. How freaking sweet is that? So we can set our cruise control. So we got to remember, they like to work in a square. Which is very neat. But yeah, when's the last time you guys had a worker follow you down the road? Like, th these guys met us. That is really, really cool. Oh, and there's the other guy. He must have done whatever he was doing. You see him back there? This is our farm over here. So yeah, this is really, really cool. I think it... it okay, like half of it is you know, looking at a different experience than Farming Sim, right? And we, we all know that I'm kind of meh with Farming Sim. Uh, Riverview is definitely fun. Uh, we've made it really, really fun by giving us uh, a ton of money. But this is just completely different. Like, this is a different kind of game. Like, it's not as arcadey. Uh, some of the stuff I'm really, really liking, and Farming Sim needs to, like, pay attention and do some of these things. Like, these guys coming to see us is really freaking cool right now. Um, like, I am thoroughly pleased. And if I'm reading this correctly, is he going to drive the same path? No way. No way. Or you were like really full. Okay. So I think we're in the 20th of August, right? So that's like completely different. Um, yeah, it's the 20th of August. This is the way I'm reading that. Yeah, this is this is what I expect out of like FS21, but I'm kind of worried, um, mainly because I think the farm sim is in the the triple A aspect of things. They just want to turn on the game and make some money now, and I hope that they don't do that because you know they can make something like. This game is not going to be a competitor to Farm Sim. Um, maybe Cattle and Crops 2? Cattle and Crops 2021 or something? I don't know. But uh, this game, as a direct competitor right now, is not going to happen. Um, it's too rough around the edges. Like, it's extremely rough. But... Um... I think that 
FS definitely needs to take a few ideas, especially from the worker department. I mean, yeah, they're like a little confused right now, but they're doing their own thing. Like, look, he's off. He is, he is going places. He's going to go see some things. Um, he would go see a lot better things if I move my own tractor. I'll do that really quick. Because I put this here. It's in. Yep, I know. I put it back, back in. No, he's gonna. He's gonna dump it himself. Okay. Seriously. Farm sim. Come on, guys. Like he's gonna dump it himself. And that's amazing. Oh my god! I could actually do a job all the way through without having to stop. Oh my god, I wouldn't have the cart. And we don't need to have, uh, horse play. Like, okay. Okay, you got me, guys. I'm driving too fast. I've anchored that AI, though. Like, they're, they're driving like a normal person would drive. I'm... I... That... Just the workers. Just the workers. Kills me. Like... They work. So awesome. Oh my god. That's amazing. Like, I, I've never, I, I am completely new to, to this, to, to this part of the game, uh, for this game. I, I've never used the, their worker thing, so them doing their thing, I'm not like on some track, I'm not like, you know, following some GPS thing, like I'd have to do course play. They're not on like any kind of keypad. I haven't done anything. They... They just come out here and they work. Like, like I can't. Uh, I'm really, 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 really surprised. God, if the game just run better, that is the thing, right? If the game just run better, because this is really, really neat. I bet you. I don't even know if it has multiplayer. But if it has multiplayer, I bet it doesn't work for the darn. No, dude, come on. We got shit to do. Come on. Oh, the other guy's back already. Wow. They know. Didn't we have a third? Yeah, he's still down there. He's just hanging out. I bet you we get to go do that next. Okay, I'm, I'm really, like, happy with this. It's pretty cool. No, dude, we're gonna finish out my field. Brother. Okay, so let's uh, turn it off, and we'll roll it up again. Eh, yeah, you see, like, there's some texture issues and everything. But all the lines are all 3D, so that's really cool. Okay, so I'm going across the street. I can even, I can even put everything up. Get her unfolded again. Yeah. 
He's gonna be my helper this time. The other guy? I'm going. Don't don't want to beep at me. I'm going. So yeah, that's uh this is harvesting in cattle and crops for silage. Um I don't know how to open up this floor menu. Maybe maybe we should try to do that really quick. And I don't know if I can get a helper. Um that's where we need to go. Alright. Do we have P? It's one of these keys. It's like an F key or something. Um. Oh yeah, it's all this stuff. So, we can get the uh, 750. We can get a Dusva. We can get a bunch of trailers. There's some Mercedes I was talking about. I've used like most of this stuff. Um, the equipment selection is very, very small, but I like cloths, cloths, flowers, glass, I like glass, so, um, yeah, it's, it's a win for me, uh, the Mercedes is really, really cool, I know, um, a bunch of you guys know I've done the, the video on the Mercedes Unimog. I really like the, the Unimog. I really like the Mercedes style of tractor. I think they look really cool. They might be worth shit in the real world, but um, from my <laughs> from just like looking at a tractor and liking it, I'm okay with it. Uh, it's got that old time feel, which I like. But a lot of you guys know that I really, really like that stuff. And yeah, so. This <laughs> is, yeah, I'm, I'm glad I'm not this. It makes everything nice. It makes me think about, like, things. You know, you got to have something that uh, puts things into perspective for what you've got, right? So, I had blinders on to what farm sim was. And uh, now I don't. So, even though this is not a very quote-unquote good game it is a very good tech demo of what uh of what the publisher should be putting out for the developer um so seeing that this little small team put together something like this makes me wonder what exactly was Giants doing for two years, right? And, like, I hate talking bad about Giants because they're really, really nice. But if you're not going to put out the best product that you can possibly put out, I mean, 19 is pretty, no doubt. But whenever I play a simulator, I want to play a simulator. I hope that makes, like, a little bit of sense. And this game is more simulator than farming sim. Um, because now they want to do esports as bail stacking or something. And I'm sorry, but no. Um, there's nothing fast about farm work. There's nothing fast that they could possibly do with farm work. So, you know, it kind of makes me a little bit angry that that's what they're kind of going for at any moment I'm expecting Giants to go hey yeah we got paid mods or something uh, I just I've got that feeling and I don't mind DLC um, the Big Bud DLC was my favorite um, as most of you know I really enjoyed the Big Bud DLC I really enjoyed a lot of these well, where's my other tractor if you're going to leave me? Do I not get another one? Do I got to wait on him? Is nobody else going to come down here?
Okay. I was praising this game. Do I have a parking brake? So, like, you can go up and down here, right? So we've got all kinds of actions. Um... I don't know why it keeps wanting to do this. Can I, like, make you stop? Just stop rolling! Okay. Off. Don't roll. Okay, that automatically started. I don't know what park is. Handbrake. Space. There we go. So, the sliders and the buttons. So if we're inside, and I hit this button. Okay, this guy goes up and comes back down. I can set how much it's tilted, right? How much it's tilted this way. We can do windows. If I look at the left window, like a dummy. So if I go that, you know, door opens. Uh, if I go to the right, that door opens, right? Uh, oh, oh, better close up. Not close. Close. There we go. What else is here? So we got windows. So I'm gonna open up. Uh, I don't know what this front one is. Uh, we're gonna see. Oh, it's a mirror. Oh my god, I have mirror adjustments. No freaking way. Okay, so it's up and down. No way. Can I do it with this? Oh. Game, you are a godsend. Okay, so I can definitely do it with this. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Alright, that's pretty cool. What else we got? Door handle. Engine start. Parking brake. Full drive. Uh, button to get in and out, right? Yep. Does it learn? No, it doesn't. Dang it. Okay, so is my guy back? Yes, he is. Where did my field go? Whoa. Okay. That was a weird bug. So let's get turned back on here. I don't know why. Um... Wait, so I'm like really, really high. Let's do this. The scroll down here a bit. Do I have the button? For this guy? <gasps> I can set my height. Okay. <laughs> I'm done playing, because that is really cool. But yeah, there's like so many like little controls like that. And that's just on this one. Uh, every vehicle has its own set of controls. On the not these axioms, but the, uh, oh, what's the little one? The little tractor I've got up there. I can't remember what they're called. Um, I can raise the center, center hitch height. So, um, what I was doing earlier, just goofing around, was I was pulling a trailer. And lowered the hitch all the way down. <laughs> and just to see if it would, like, change the weight. And it kind of does. Not the best way, but it kind it tries. Let's say that. It tries. It seems to be doing better here. Um, they're not trying to ram me this time, so that's uh, that's definitely a, a, a progress made. Now, fields though, they seem to be a set like a hard boundary. Um, you can kind of see the line right there to the right. Like we know where this field is. It has a different kind of look to it. And I wonder what that does. Like, I don't think that I can create a field. That is kind of bothersome because I really, really like creating fields. I like uh, creating more realistic fields. So that not being a thing is uh, slightly upsetting. Uh, I haven't tried it, per se. 
uh, because there's a checkbox that is grayed out um, it says I can only work in like some fields um, and I don't know if that's something that's not been like done yet so I'm unsure but mission complete drive to the vehicle tree well let's just hit this button so we're gonna hit complete mission uh, nope we shall continue I guess don't want to stop if uh, you know things aren't done okay so this is what I was talking about we get up here to the blue line and then we just hit in I'm not driving this is the game driving it's uh, gonna drive itself to the dealer to the exact spot that it's supposed to be in right it's not that far it's only a couple field some of the fields are pretty big um, like that's a pretty decent chunk of field right there. Not huge by any means. Um, I don't think there's much bigger than that one. Uh, not by the looks of it. So the ones towards the center of the map are our biggest ones. And look, this frees up time for me to talk. <laughs> so these are fields that we own. This one, this one, this one, this one. This one and this one, I think, is what that means. So, what is the. Uh, yeah, this field 21. Oh, okay. Oh, I don't mean to click these. Oh, oh, oh I don't want to follow the player. Click this off. There we go. Uh, what is this? Field 3. Okay, well, that's kind of cool. You highlight things. But yeah, so they drive themselves all the way back. This thing is nasty dirty. Looking pretty good though. I kind of like the texture, not really. I don't like how the guy is not holding the wheel. Um, that may be because I have adjusted it. But uh, he's a very British middle aged man. Or very German. And then attach the Orbis. Which is the, the front thing. So let's go up here. Detach. And there we go. So my an this gives you like an overview. Like all my animals are hungry, right? So I need to close all these. And you get XP um, for something. Don't know what, but I've got a bunch of it. Uh, my animals are hungry. Um, new missions, don't care. Yeah, so, there's like, yeah, we've got like all kinds of stuff to do. I will continue to do this every once in a bit. Don't care about these notifications, like, at all. Okay. So, what, uh, I can't remember what changes the vehicle. Can't, uh, let's see here. Right mouse cursor, run next vehicle is Z. So, yeah, this is like the little class we've got. This is the Mercedes, which is like my favorite because it is old and mechanical. Let's hop out here. Some of the, the toolbars and everything. I can't remember the brands. Uh, I think this is like a Cockerling. Yep. Uh, Mercedes and like our, our normal. German farmhouse thing. We got some animals. I don't know much about our animals. I don't know much about like checking them. So there's like an alt that shows their fee a fill level. Um, but other than that, I don't know m like much about uh, you know looking at things. I don't think I can open up doors. No. So yeah, that is uh, harvesting silage and cattle crops, and you can't jump. So, I'm, I'm like smashing the space bar. Can't jump. Oh, I got a pressure washer. Really? Can I use this? That is what that is, right? Yeah. Use this. Um. No, it won't let me use it. 
Ah, okay. Well, there it is. There's our very first ever thing on Cattle and Crops. If you like it, let me know. If you didn't, let me know. And I'll see you in tomorrow's video.